in southern Alaska. Back to the fun stuff. Mike Willard bankrolled a costly trip to claim a new trap line in Mount Durrell Valley. Working with his friend, veteran trapper Dave, he needs high value wolverine fur to make it pay off. Well, there it is. Damn it. Looks like we're dealing with a big one that knows what he's doing here. Dave's deerskin bait is gone. He's confident it was taken by a crafty wolverine. He clearly dug it out. He just went right in and took the bait. Wolverines seem to be professionals at snapping traps. That's because they're always digging around and they're using their nose to see if there's anything buried under the snow. Probably came in through the side. That's the only way he could snap that and not get caught in it. You set some snares back here a little ways, right? Yeah, I got a couple of snares. Hey, Dave, we got him. Oh, man, he is big. Well, we could tell by the tracks he was big. Yeah. You got him just perfect, too. He's right on the neck. That's a quick kill. That's what I like about snares. The most important thing is using the correct traps for the correct animals to make sure that you catch them in a way that's as humane as possible. Got it. I finally have this wolverine, gorgeous male. Uh, it's a big wolverine. I would say it's in the top 10%. Well, that wolverine is good for between four and 500 bucks. That's a pretty good day. Finally, Mike's gamble to claim Mount Durrell Valley is starting to pay. If we can get some more gear out, I'm confident we can catch some more. You've got to take risks to get fur. But this trap line gives us so much potential for this season and future season. We're not at the top of the food chain here. We're living in the animal's environment. There's a lot of ways to die out here. You gotta be tough to survive.